what's up youtube i'm zero zeus and welcome back to another video so this video if you used to if you watch me before put it like i'm gonna put it like this you already know what this is about to be this is gonna be my devil may cry 5 reaction and if it, it like i'm gonna say this again if you have watched me before you know i mentioned devil may cry before i'm a huge fan and i know it's like an elephant in the room and it's lingering i'm gonna get to that later but first we're gonna start the video because i'm just this is my first video being back and i'm just trying to jump head first into it so let's go ahead and get on with the video and see what it's about For the longest time, I had already been talking about how they need to bring Devil May Cry back. That's like one of my favorite franchises, one of them as a kid, especially still now, even as, as I'm grown. But it's like it was really hyped to me as a kid. I love Devil May Cry. I love Dante, even though it kind of it's kind of in the way a little bit that I secretly wish he was the main character. It's okay, as long as Devil May cries back, I have nothing to complain about, and I'll take it, country girl and all. <laughs> See, and I don't want to go pause in the video, because I, I always hate it when I do it myself, so I know other people hate it, but... At first, first sight seeing this, when I first um, seen the thumbnail for a video that was dealing with this, and I seen him, and I'm like, is that Nero? And it's like... It looks like he got got the weapons right, and it looks like he got the sword too at the same time, right? And his colors are similar, <clears throat> and the arm thing. But I thought it'd be really lame if like Nero cut off his arm and you know had to get a robotic arm when he already had a cool arm that does everything that this arm maybe everything that this arm does itself. But it's like they, I'm pretty sure a new game they probably gonna add new features to like the arm. I guess combat, the special arm combat, I guess, I guess I could call it. It's like either way, every character, they're different, but then they're just alike too. I hate, I'm not trying to hoard them, but they all put me in the mind of, yeah, that remind me of young Dante, especially when they're like trash talking. And, <laughs> but I like that though. That's not a bad thing, not to me. And I really hope they were talking about the playable characters in this game and then i heard a couple rumors back before i even was able to get back on youtube like virgil was in the game it's a lot of things that's just going on that i really want to know about this like first of all okay we can pause this so i, I can keep yapping because i basically just yapped the whole video and didn't pay any attention to what was going on i did but not really like that but i'm just so happy to be back i'm just i have so much to say so for one i want to know what's going on with virgil to be totally honest because after devil may cry three it was just never explored anymore not that i know of maybe something a couple of things flew over my head or something i don't know but it wasn't made certain what had actually happened like is it over for him is he dead or you know like so maybe somebody knows if you do know please comment below and stuff like that but anyway Another thing is Nero. I was reading before I did this video. I was reading, doing a little homework about it, I guess you could call it, and trying to see what, like, what, what, what does some of the websites have to say? Credible websites. I'm not just one of those people who go look on Wikipedia or something like that. I actually do my homework. So supposedly they said it a couple years in the future i don't know why it just makes me think about logan when i see devil when i see um dante but anyway they wanted it to be a couple years in the future so that nero could be a little bit older i guess and be in his prime be the best that he could be i guess and i guess that's cool but at the same time okay this is one thing that i do not understand about dmc Okay, I, I always figured that they didn't age, being that they were demons. I, I don't know, maybe, maybe, maybe people look at me like I'm stupid. Like, who says there's an unwritten law that demons don't age? But I thought they didn't. But anyway, so Dante being old, it's not that much of a problem. I don't like it, but it's not that much of a problem, but I'm just saying. So 
yeah, but we're we going to start this over and just have this playing in the background. And I'm going to try to point out a couple of things because usually I dissect the video in my own way at first. And then I start yapping about things that have nothing to do with nothing. But now this guy right here, I wonder who that is. Is that just going to be Mundus or, or something? Like, I, I, does he have anything to do with this game? Because I have done my homework, but it hasn't really gave me that much information, to be totally honest. So... And then I was reading, they act like Dante is going crazy or something. Like something's going on, something's wrong with him. Something's happened to him and he's, he's just wilding. And I would really like to know why. And I want, I can't wait for this game to come out even though I think it's supposed to be like 2019-ish. So we got a long time before that happens. But hey, what can you do? But so far, it, it looks straight. And it, it, it definitely puts me in the mind of, old school devil may cry i don't know why just all that right then the slow motion and that it just always puts me in the mind the devil may cry three for real for real especially it reminds me of that and i forgot this guy's name and i was kind of i'm like man why would it be somebody new if you were gonna let us be anybody let us be nero and then there's like this other black haired guy i don't know who he is or what he has going on but i guess supposedly he's gonna be that third playable character and i feel like that is so whack because nero even though he's not may not be important to everybody i feel like he is important enough to still be a playable character in this game in virgil too you would want to see how far virgil's progressed by now too if he is able to be part of this game but um anyway before this video ends up being like 10 or 20 minutes me just yapping about all the things i like and don't like i'm gonna end it right here because i plan on making a couple of more because i'm trying to just flood the channel really fast and just have a couple of videos out there so and i'm gonna have an explanation video if you actually watch me and care to you know care about that type of thing but um anyway this is the end of the video. I've been Zero Zeus. This has been my Devil May Cry 5 reaction. Please like, subscribe, share, and comment. Thank you for watching, and I will see you all next video. And there will be a next video.